Hey guys, so the man with the mustache is back. So we have the latest Agatha Christie adaptation. And I'm actually really excited for this. I would go as far as to say this is one of my most anticipated movies of the year after the Meg 2. Yes, I am really excited about a movie about a giant shark. What can I say? We all have our guilty pleasures. So another huge guilty pleasure of mine i don't know why we say guilty pleasure i'm not guilty of anything i love scary movies that go in that gothic horror direction and that is the impression i got from this trailer so this is a well not sequel but the latest adaptation after murder in the orient express death on the nile and now we have a haunting in venice and there's just so many things I love about this movie. I love Venice. I've been lucky enough to get to go there and it's such a beautiful haunting sort of place. So I've always thought that it was a really great setting for a horror movie. Then we've got Ricardo Scamasio. I doubt I'm saying that right. So he played the villain in John Wick Chapter 2 and I've always thought he was a good actor. So he's going to be in this. Jamie Dornan, there's a whole bunch of, it's a pretty stacked cast, so we have a really good cast for this. So, look, I don't really think that it's going to be supernatural. I think it's going to be sort of a bait and switch sort of thing because it reminds me of those Scooby Doo cartoons where Scooby and the gang would unmask the killer who's been pretending to be like a ghost the whole time I feel like that's what's going to happen here I just don't get the vibe from this series that it would go supernatural though I don't know it's meant to be based on an Agatha Christie book I forget the name it's about a Halloween party I'll put it up there so if any of you have read the book let me know is it actually a supernatural book or not but either way it looks like it's going to be a really good movie it's coming out in september so i'm guessing they did that strategically because then they could put it out on vod around halloween time after its theatrical run so yeah let's go check out the trailer Oh, that reminds me of that thing from The Conjuring. Everyone who ever lived here falls victim to some tragedy. Like her daughter a year ago. My daughter was my whole life. Oh, pretty. To hear her voice again, I would give all I have. Someone wants to be heard. We are here. All the imagery is so pretty. someone who gets scared easily but I can genuinely say this trailer creeped me out so I would like it if they do go in that paranormal direction but like I said I don't think that they will but who knows maybe they will either way it looks really genuinely creepy and I always feel like gothic type horror has that effect on me you know like that 
show The Haunting of Hill House, which if you haven't seen it on Netflix, I highly, highly recommend it. So anyway, look, this reminds me of the episode as well, like Buffy and Supernatural. They've all done episodes with ghost children that are orphans. It seems to be like wherever there's an orphanage, there has to be some dark, scary backstory about something that's happened there. Anyway, I think this looks really good. I can't wait to see it. I'll definitely be seeing it in the cinema. So let me know down below what you thought of it. Please subscribe or just give this video a like. It really helps me out. Thank you.